Jermel Charlo shocks the boxing world with a one-punch knockout of Jason Rosario in the eighth round. He is now the unified junior middleweight champion of the world. Stay tuned. It's the champ! Where'd you find this? It's your boy Young Cantu coming at you with another fight review. Big night of boxing uh, pay-per-view cards. The Charlos went off tonight. Jermel Charlo stops Jason Rosario with a body shot in the eighth round to stun the boxing world. What a performance by Charlo. He now improves to 34 and 1 with 18 knockouts. And I gotta say, man, the way he put Rosario down with that body shot was unbelievable. It was a straight jab right to the body, right to the abs. Took the win right out of Rosario. And if you've ever been hit to the body or if you've played football, I used to be a quarterback. I've taken a shot right to the ribs. You ever taken, got your win taken out of you, man? There is no way you can recover. You can't breathe. You can't, you can't, uh, you know, get your wits about you, man. And, and, and Charlo basically took the heart out of Rosario, man. What a performance by Charlo. So coming into this fight, you know, I saw it as a close fight. And for the most part, other than the first and I believe the fifth round where Rosario was knocked down by left hooks by Charlo, this was a competitive fight. We saw Char uh, we saw Rosario walking forward, uh, applying pressure, throwing body shots. A lot of his shots were low. He was warned in the sixth round for a low body shot. But uh, Charlo was moving laterally. He was very composed throughout this fight. I am very impressed. I always knew Charlo had, you know, great patience and reading IQ, but he showed it on a different level in this fight. He was moving laterally. He was holding on the inside when he felt uncomfortable when Rosario was trying to apply pressure. He was doing all the little savvy tricks to win the fight. And yes, he got caught a couple times. And yes, he threw a couple wild punches, you know, but he's throwing caution to win. He's trying to knock homeboy out. But overall, Jermel Charlo, man, I am very impressed with this man. And I feel like he's matured and he's changed his attitude just as an individual. You know, the way he carries himself after the fight, being very gracious and, and concerned about Rosario and his well-being. Uh, you know, you, just the way he spoke, the way he approached this fight. You can tell Jermel Charlo is a different fighter than he was a year ago. Uh, two years ago he's just matured he's taken that next step into his career and it's up here that's the difference for Jamel Charlo and that's what I saw tonight um, the body shot just an amazing punch that just like I said took the win out of Rosario and man I, I don't think I've seen a knockout like that where it was a straight jab to the body and Rosario it's like he couldn't breathe he couldn't use his core to get up because his win was gone it was a perfectly placed punch and you know this is a sensational performance by Jermel Charlo you got to give the man credit let's break down the fight it was a 10-8 round on in the first round uh, Charlo caught Rosario with a left hook toward the end of the round high on the head uh, the legs went right out of Rosario the second round I gave 10-9 to Charlo he was using his jab lateral movement ring generalship Rosario was still warming up into the fight um, the third round I gave to Rosario because he started attacking, he started pressing the issue, landing combos, body shots. Mel was composed though. He was composed throughout the fight. The only time where he, Rosario did get some momentum was when he had lulls of not throwing a lot of punches, not that much activity. But overall, it was just his game plan. He was using lateral movement, he was holding on the inside, he was pot shotting. Uh, you know, he wasn't outlanding Rosario in a couple of those rounds, but you could tell on the verbiage that his trainer Derek James was giving him in the corner that it was part of the game plan he knew he was gonna break him down but I don't think he knew he was gonna knock him out with a body shot straight jab to the abs man so you know this is an indication that this man Jermel Charlo has matured and he's really taking it to the next level and like I said it's up here for him he's changed his attitude you could just tell and how he talks in the press and and the lead up to this fight um the focus everything man he he's a different fighter than he was so shout out to jermel charlo um great performance tonight it's your boy young Cantu. thanks for tuning in make sure you hit the like button on this video and subscribe to the youtube channel